guys, it's Shannon Rose, and in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a what's in my diaper bag. I'm so excited to do this video. You have no idea. So I just finished filming what's in my hospital bag. So if you haven't seen that video, definitely go check it out. But yeah, I thought I would do this. A lot of you guys requested this video, and I've watched a lot of them. Not recently, but in the past when I was trying to get pregnant, and so I'm so grateful I'm able to finally do my own. <laughs> Very exciting moment for me. This is the bag, the diaper bag I ended up going with. It is a backpack. A lot of people told me to do the backpack version and so I did, I listened. This is the Itsy Ritzy bag and I love that it's all black because I feel like it'll match everything. It's very just like chic and classy. Um, and it also has the little like stroller hook things attached to it if I wanted to use that. So I love it so far. Obviously haven't used it yet. Baby's still in my tummy, but it has this really cool pocket on top. I don't know how to describe it. It's like um, the material on the inside is nice. So you can put like your sunglasses or your keys or your vlog camera if you're a YouTuber. So yeah, it's kind of like your own little secret pouch right there, which I think is really cool. So I'll probably use it for like my keys and my camera. Um, Cause this is gonna be like my diaper bag and my purse in one. It also has a little pocket on the side here um, that's insulated I think for like your water or bottles. And then on this side, it has a, I hope you guys can see this okay, another insulated section. And I think that you can put also like bottles or snacks or something in here to keep cold if you wanted. And then another cool thing on the back is they have this zipper and actually has a changing pad. So that's pretty nifty. So cute, I can't wait to use all this stuff. So yeah, I think that they have that like separate so you can like wipe it down and it's not like unsanitary putting it with the rest of the bag. So I think that's really cool how they have that pocket. Okay, so then they have also two little front pockets here and then an open pocket here. And in this pocket, I just have the um, Dr. Brown's pacifier and bottle wipes. I'm sure like <laughs> if you're like a second, third, fourth time mom, you don't have these, but as a first time mom, they make the joke like, oh, for your first child, you like drop a pacifier and you clean it and sanitize everything. And then your second kid, you don't care. You like <laughs> take it up and just put it in their mouth. And then in this little front pocket right here, I kind of have stuff for me, which is, um, I will show you. It is the Lansino like breast pad things. And then some other ones. I got a bunch of samples. And then also some um, milk bags, like breast storage milk bags, in case I'm lucky enough to breastfeed and I have to like pump when I'm out. Uh, I have that in this pocket. And then in this pocket, I have some boogie wipes. <laughs> Thinking back, like my mom probably never had stuff like this. They just like used like probably a baby wipe, but they have like actual boogie wipes now. So I have that and I think that's all that's in there. Okay, let's get into the big pocket now. That's all the little fun pockets. By the way, I bought it. I bought all this on my own. <laughs> it's not sponsored or anything. I really like this bag because it goes all the way down. Isn't that so cool? I plan on taking this to the hospital. And for those of you guys that don't know or maybe new to my channel, um, my husband and I are pretty strict vegans. And so we obviously would like our daughter to be um, also. So we want to, if for some reason I'm not able to breastfeed or my milk doesn't come in in time, I am bringing some um, organic non-GMO soy uh, like formula for her. So... Yeah, so that she doesn't have like actual dairy. I think it would really hurt her tummy if this whole time I've been feeding her no dairy <laughs> and being a strict like vegan pregnancy and then all of a sudden if they, like we had to formula feed her at the hospital and they gave her like a dairy product or introduced that to her, I think it might make her like sick. I don't know, I'm just assuming. So I'm bringing some vegan formula for her. Okay, what else is in here? So we'll start at the top pockets. This is just some um, butt paste and also like a little travel size, um, but what are these things called? Baby bum thing. Some people are like, why don't you just put it on with your hand? And um, I heard it's like hard to get off. So I think it's just better to use this and easier so that you don't like make a mess. Who knows? I don't know if I'm end up using this stuff or not, but it's in here just in case. And I plan on like having this stuff all the time in here, so that's why there's um, butt paste. <laughs> it's 
so crazy for like in case they get diaper rash. And then in this pocket, I have some water wipes. I also have two of these little like washcloth things. Are they washcloth? I think they're wa washcloths or burp cloth. <laughs> like so. I have no idea what these things are. Like spit up cloths or whatever. That's I think what I'm trying to say. So she like spits up or makes a mess, whatever. I just have these things. Um, I also have some diapers for her in here. This is probably not nearly enough, but you know, I could put some more in. These are so tiny and cute, you guys. Are these not the cutest little baby diapers? I'm pretty sure they're newborn size. I should probably put newborn and size one, just in case, because my baby's already really big. I don't know, let me know in the comments. What do you think I should do? <laughs> then I just have like a little baby blanket. I also have another baby blanket. Like this is more of like a swaddle. Um, I hope you guys can see what I'm pulling out. I think the lights are kind of bright, but yeah, just like a little swaddle. It's really soft and comfortable. And then I also have in here a nursing wrap cover, car seat cover, you know, like the all-in-one cover. And I kind of just like have them rolled up and neat so I can see everything. My OCD is like putting everything back perfectly the way it, the way I had it before. And then over here, I have one of these little, what are these things called? Like a security blanket with the little elephant. So cute, super soft. And then I also have, so this is like a whole outfit plus another half of an outfit all rolled up in one. You guys should follow me on the vlog channel if you don't so I can show you how to do this because it'll be really hard to do it right, <laughs> right now. But it basically is like a really cool KonMari method way of like putting a bunch of clothes and folding it up like really compact. So this is kind of like her extra change of outfit in case she has like a blowout or something like that. So that's in there and then her little like security blanket thing is right there. And then there's another pocket over here and in this pocket, Oh, I'm not gonna show you this, but this is actually her going home outfit and I had it custom made on Etsy. It has like her name on it and everything. It's so, so, so stinking cute. I can't wait to um, show you guys what that looks like. So yeah, her little going home outfit is in here. And then on the sides, there's some extra little pockets here. And this I just have like um, gripe water, the little remedies gripe water thing. And that's it in that pocket. <gasps> I just found a secret hidden passage pocket way in here. Oh my goodness, I didn't even know this existed <laughs> until just now. There's another little pocket in here, how cool. So, um, and then there's like a little thing here that you could put your keys, which I didn't even know that was there. How cool. Okay, so that's everything that's in like the main part of the bag. And then on this part of the bag, there is, my big old belly is getting in the way. <laughs> I'm gonna readjust, there we go. Um, on this part of the bag, we'll start at the bottom. I just have like two pairs of little socks for her. And then these little like newborn zero to three soothe pacifiers. And then in the top pocket, I just have another, I think this is totally empty. I think this is just gonna be for like my stuff. So it's just like an empty little bag in the zipper pocket to keep like any medications, Tylenol, like chapstick, I don't know, mainly stuff for me probably to have a little section in here. And then I still have a lot of room, like if I wanted to put more stuff up in here, but that's pretty much everything that's in my diaper bag. Am I missing anything? Obviously I'll have like bottles and stuff like that, but I think I'll have a separate, like if I'm nursing, like a separate bag for like my breast pump and bottles and stuff like that. But. So far that's everything that's in here. If I'm missing anything or you guys have any advice for me of what I should add into this bag, let me know down in the comment section below. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sending you all my love and all my positive energy and I hope to see you in my next video. Mwah! This reminds me of snow skiing and I miss it. Snowboarding and stuff. Okay. Thanks, honey. <laughs>